So you think animals are cute? Jeez, Internet, what have you been watching? Oh, look at him with his little face and his big eyes. Okay, okay yeah, that's pretty cute. You're right. But some animals are just so far from cute that they can only be described as bleh or oh or <sighs> I'm Jessie. This is Animal Wonders Montana, and I'm about to show you some creepy crawly animal goodness. Imagine yourself relaxing on vacation in South America, basking in the warm sun of the deserts of Chile, reading an awesome book. We feel a little tickle on the back of your arm. You slowly turn around. And you see, oh, it's just a scrub brush blowing against you. So you move a little bit, readjust, turn back to your book, and ah! Eight eyes, eight furry legs, and two pointy venomous fangs. Who wouldn't love this gal, right? This is Fluffy, the Chilean rose-haired tarantula. These tarantulas are so amazing because they're specialized hairs called urticating hairs. And it's not located on the front side, that scary side. It's actually located on the back side. They use these urticating hairs to defend themselves when they feel threatened by a potential predator like you. They do this by kicking those urticating hairs off their abdomen with their back legs and they become lodged in the eyes and soft facial tissues of the predator. If that doesn't deter you, they're gonna turn right back around, rise up, showing off those beautiful venom-filled fangs. If you're a cricket, you should be very scared right now. There are about 800 species of tarantulas and luckily, none of them are deadly to humans. Of course, there are plenty of other animals that are deadly and would happily eat you or at least lay their young inside you to eat you after they hatch. Luckily, we don't have any parasites to show you. But we do have one of the largest scorpions in the world! This is Professor Claw, the Emperor Scorpion, another eight-legged arachnid. Emperor scorpions are found in the forest floors and savannas in many areas of Africa, and they're best known for that black color and their enormous claws. Of course, there's a little something on the back end too, but who really cares about that? It's just a venom-filled telson, ready to potentially inject you with life-ending fluid. Yeah, about that deadly venom? Well, about 25 species of scorpions can kill a human. Of course, there's 1,750 species, so your chances of not dying are fairly high. This is one of her baby scorplings, three months old. Come on, it's cute. Look how cute it is. It's a baby. It has to be cute. Okay, maybe it's kind of creepy. Oh, look at the creepy scorpling. So most people don't have to worry about massive tarantulas or enormous scorpions hiding out in their shoe, but no one would go untraumatized if you turn on the light and you saw the quick scurry of a hundred six-legged uninvited house guests. Hello, cockroaches! They don't have eight legs like our scorpions or our spiders, so that makes them the misfits of our little show here. Oh, poor little cockroaches, all left out in the six-legged corner, can't sit at the eight-legged cool table. Poor little guy being teased called insect and dirty decomposer and don't you feel sorry for this little bugger. Cockroaches don't need your pity. They are indestructible forces of nature. This guy's costume for Halloween is the Headless Horseman and it's better than yours because he actually goes headless. Just because he can. Hmm? Of course he'll only live for about two weeks because he'll eventually die of starvation but it's totally worth it. I bet you never looked a cockroach in the eye and told him how you really felt. Here's your chance. This little cutie, uh, creepy, just molted, and you can see her little black eyes being adorable. I'm uh, terrifying. It's, she's absolutely terrifying. Cockroaches come in over 4,000 species, but no one cares about the amazing diversity or the adaptive awesomeness of the cockroach, but you should. Instead, it's all about the scurrying and the scuttling and the creepy crawling. So the next time you're up for a midnight snack, don't turn on that light. You're gonna scare away all your six-legged friends. Who just want to be like the cool kids. And when your little baby kitty is so cute and adorable playing with those shoelaces, remember, Professor Claw's cousin might be hanging out in your shoe waiting for that vulnerable toe. And the next time you're watching Little Miss Cuteness being all cute and adorable and fluffy on YouTube, remember the real Fluffy because she'll be the one perched in the corner watching over your shoulder. Thank you for watching Animal Wonders Halloween special. And a special thank you to our subbable subscribers and all of our other supporters for helping us create this content. If you want to be a part of animal education and rescue work, you can follow the links below and you can learn all about how you can be a supporter too. And if you want to keep learning about animals creepy or cute, 
subscribe to our YouTube channel, Animal Wonders Montana, and as always, you can find me on Twitter, Tumblr, and Facebook. Links are below. Oh wait, that's a cockroach. I think I made a mistake. Maybe I should just go back to the door. Vamps are real. They own Morganville. But you're safe with us.